this question uh, given in gate 2013 EC paper where a op amp based circuit is given we need to find out output voltage V out. Below this question NPTEL lecture related to this topic is provided. Before going to solve this problem we need to understand what is an inverting amplifier. In inverting configuration the output voltage V out is 180 degrees out of phase with input voltage V in. In ideal op amp, there is a virtual short experiences between this inverting terminal and non-inverting terminal. Here non-inverting terminal is connected to ground, so 0 was a pair across this terminal. Due to the virtual short phenomena, this mode voltage is also 0 volts. Op amp draws no current, so in this direction current equals to 0. Apply KCL at this node. So, 0 minus V in by R in plus 0 minus V out by RF equals to 0. So, after simplifying this equation, V out equals to minus RF by R1 into V. So, from this equation, we can say that output voltage V out is 180 degrees out of phase with input V. That means, if V in is a positive voltage, output is negative. If V in is negative, output voltage V out is positive. Using this information, we can solve the given problem. So, here both op amps, op amp 1 and op amp 2 connected in inverting configuration. Here op amp 1, the non-inverting terminal is connected to 1 volt source via a resistance 1 kilo volt. We know that ideal op amp draws no current. So, here I equals to 0. That means, there is no voltage drop across this resistor. So, this 1 volt will appear across this node. So, there is a virtual short between this inverting terminal and non-inverting terminal. So, here also 1 volt appears. Apply KCL at this node V1. I will assume this node voltage is V2. Apply KCL at node V1. So, V1 minus 2 volts by 1 kilo ohm plus V1 minus V2 by 1 kilo ohm equals to 0. There is no current in this direction because op amp draws no current. We know that V1 equals to 1 volt. So, after simplifying this equation, V2 equals to 4 volts. That means here 4 volts APS. Again, this op amp 2 connected in inverting configuration. So, there is a virtual short between this non-inverting terminal and inverting terminal. So, here also 4 volts APS. Input terminal op amp draws no current. So, apply KCL at this node, then I will assume this node voltage is V3. So, V3 minus here 0 volts by 1 kilo ohm, 1 kilo ohm plus V3 minus 3 minus V out by 1 kilo ohm equals to. 0. So, V out 
equals to 2 into V3. We know that V3 equals to 4 volts. So, 2 into 4 volts equals to 8 volts. So, the output voltage of this op amp is 8 volts.